It's actually going to be a mirror with the exception of Troy on the Zarya. I have to think this favors uh, uh, the San Francisco Shock, at least in the neutral game. Put TP to this flanking high ground. So now Shocker in a great position. If they lose anybody, then that player will come back to spawn into Atlanta's back. Super. Take the initiative. Oh. Falls out on both sides. And Hurst is so hard to foul of Super in the freezer there from both teams. As the Shock take first blood and then some. Here, just breaking out of that ugly hole then. Oh, that's a tough start for the rain. That was great from Super. Got isolated in the corner by the Maywall. Realized he couldn't escape it. And then just the epitome of, I'm not locked in here with you. You're locked in here with me. Play. Super. Yep. All that's required. Then from there. Gotta look. Enough action as we get back to the next fight. Choi charging up that ground for Surge. Goals available for both teams. Looks like we're going to move towards it. No, they will. It's going to be a trade, but the sim wall coming out from Striker. That's pretty huge in this situation. It's so easy to fight around in the Rhine Cup. Goals on both sides. Super, you know he's looking for the Earth Shatter here. Moving forward. Takes down Gaker. He doesn't uh, even need there's it. so much real estate. He's just not, they're not even worth it. And that's going to be the shot to continue to keep up their momentum. Oh, nice reverser though. This is a very annoying delay coming out from the mid. That's what she's best at. However, it means he won't really be in the fight for the recontest. If the rain go for this, which I think they will, it's going to be a 5v6 for the first moment. And you are coming up against Grab Blizzard. Hawk basically needs to eat one of these, or I think you're not going to be working out of this he is out, but the Rain is still in a tough spot. The Blizzard already in the fight, a little bit of zoning there, but also still gets caught. The Shock just swarming around the lane. Shatter coming on down. The Shock just continues to roll forward here, Jake. The Rain dealing with a very quick time bank so far from the Shock. Four minutes as they head into point B. Edison is very well early on. Transfer full comes in. Hawk. Some talk off the back. Striker caught. The rain right now is staying on the high ground. Heal. Trying to slow the pace down. Edison game oh, very, very low. Kick it away. Super put out of nowhere. Slams into Edison. And the shock are still in this fight. That yeah, was a nice pin by Gator to get super low, but. Striker gonna take the mirror match on McCree now, uh, setting up for those later situations. The flesh flying on the ultimate, and oh no, look at this corner. Maywall and Gator, he's fully isolated. They grab on everyone. It's getting real cold here. Ice balls everywhere. Gator has no chance to drop the shatter. And the shock again. They know where to initiate and make it hurt. The rain, we're not expecting that, and that should be point B. As a shock gets to set a crazy fast time. Oh, this is so bad because these staggers are going to be just deadly here. Nice job from Erster if he can escape. Oh, and even heal no, these he staggers here. So we're already going to miss the first fight here for the rain. How do you really make use of this blizzard? This is a really tough test for Erster. It's going to be very hard to find value without really set up. Uh, Shatters could be also pretty impactful. It's going to be very, very tough. At some point, you're hoping the shock oh. makes a mistake. Edison, go for the dead eye. Oh, kind of limiting his attack. It's fucking Striker! Somehow, Striker gets caught in the middle of it. Erster and Huck go down the front line. Oh, no, no, no. Don't even need Striker in this situation. Now, do we? Super setting the way the shock getting the ball through they need. And, well, even with the dead eye pickup, doesn't much matter. Yeah, and the real trouble is now that Hawk has switched off to the Zarya. Is he doesn't have an ultimate to work with, and now that he's not on Diva, there's nothing to counter this grab freeze combo. Uh, Shock know it. They're just running right to the spawn. You cannot fight us. That's what they're saying with this position, and I think they're exactly right here. I don't think there's anything that the range can do to come back in this fight. Huge grab, huge minute channel up by Striker. Just breaks bubbles. That's all he has to do. The disrespect when you set the grab from downtown. The shot still get two off it. Striker claiming oh, the high yeah. ground. Oh, Let him know. Yeah. Let him know, baby. That's a that's a brutal <laughs> dominant victory right there. You can't. That's creative and inspirational. And it's sort of add pick. Yeah, this is a this is a pretty aggressive position. Okay. Mildly. Yeah. Oh. Uh, and it's a dirty down. All right. That's fast. As Super just walks forward. Uh, you can't just let Super do this. I mean, it's not good for the lad's ego. Not at all. I mean, you, you know him pretty well, Jake. Uh, yeah, this I think is what, all, what all fans of the rain are thinking right now is just, yikes, that is not the way you want to start things off. 
just continuing to hold this high ground on the defense. Very annoying position to break. Now they're Maywall initiation. Both bubbles come down the broken. Super caught by a Maywall. This is a huge catch by Erster. That pickoff is going to give them the advantage they need to close out this first fight. However, more fights available here for the Shock, especially this Regan test. Both very, very even for both sides. Um, we'll see if Ults end up mattering. I think this is going to be mostly on the McCrees and the Maze. What kind of openings can they create for their side? Well, Edison's going to need to keep up that same level for one we saw just a moment ago. As the early Deadeye, gotta respect it, gotta back out. Oh, he missed the E shot through the light post. He got nothing off of that. Oh, no. Uh, the I don't think Light Post is too happy here as it turns out, but he lands the flash! Super! Ends up getting caught! Yeah, especially with Edison not getting anything out of High Noon like that, it's incredible that the fight was still so decisive for the raid. So now they're in this dominating position, ready to have essentially a free team fight uh, with the trap reason. Oh, what a perfect moment to go for this flank. If Rain can win this fight for free off the back of a pick, oh no. This would be so bad. Edison, he doesn't even need to get anything here. I think he should actually just retreat. This is actually pretty intelligent. They already got the one pick. He doesn't He's need just anything. quietly creeping back going, No, I, but they don't need me. It's fine. I'm just going to wait. It's a smart move there. I mean, why take the risk uh, when you're up one? Solidify your advantage. Later, hanging on to the shatter. He's in response. Edison fights Striker. Edison's just going crazy right now, even as Blizzard comes down. Blizzard's out of fight, the shot trying to take advantage. Uh, Gator drops a shatter into the shield. Block. Here comes Super on the top row. Smashes in the Gator. He can save the shatter. Yeah, now they're going to get a solid hold here. That flank from Edison sort of worked out. He got Striker, but this wasn't enough. Edison finds another weight. He's turning this fight with the coal from Dogman with Maywall Khan. So it isolates everyone in. It's an all in in the close range here. Super fighting tooth and nail to survive. He's so low. There's nothing he can do there. Striker going to make the switch over to the Reaper in the final second. Hawk has a pretty big energy lead here, though, so I think that is primarily going to define the fight. If Hawk can't stop, he should be out damaging here. Maywell comes out, blocking both sides with this guy. That's it. Oh, can he survive? Oh, just no, barely Choi gets the finish. And look at that. Striker following through. Because holding on here is so far away from the attacker spawn, so every fight the rain takes, it's going to take a very long time to set up just to get back in position to fight. That is already your pegs in like 30 seconds off the clock for that privilege. And three against Reaper can be very tough. Shadow's ready. Now tied up early, going for the pin, and quick is the back and forth. And Super still falling. So this should almost certainly be a cap here for the raid, moving on to third point. But already, the time bank is running pretty low here. And Choi almost has his grab to set up the combo with the Blizzard, so you're almost certainly looking at at least one reset here for the rain. They're just trying to finish this map at all, though. I mean, right now in the rain, you stay at the hot hand. You hope that Edison just continues setting the pace here, gets another early pickoff. That'd be the best possible opportunity to keep things rolling. And for the shot, you gotta be a little bit more methodical here. You gotta respect it. Wall out early, and the Blizzard. Mercer went in pretty deep, and the shock, they were just able to disengage. That's a perfect speed boost from Bob. Exactly the right moment. Defensive wall from on, so that the other mate can't catch him. And now, grab Blizzard, combo almost ready. Troy at 90%. Just needs a little bit more charge. Nice block from Super. Very much on the edge, though. Ball to the face. He doesn't care. The shot is still running. And he gets Shatter canceled. Stopped. He wants to get the shot off because of it. But the rain still lose the fight. Striker gets the death loss into the back. Defenders are gonna have a slight natural edge here, though. I do think fighting out of this open space, McCree's gonna be a better pick than Reaper. It's hard to get value at this mid range on Reaper when McCree's just blanking away with headshots. Two minutes left for the rain to keep the series alive to not get knocked in to the loser's bracket. Super. Pretty low right now. Flashbang over the top. And the wall. Super's in danger here. And then some. And somehow able to back out. Have enough team support. Or he does not mean dead. And he gets Gator at the end. The focus fire on the Super Fit hooks at the shot. Pull back the rain. Slightly overconfident. High noon gets double headshot by arms on the May. Showing that, hey, he's still a sniper, baby. Can't take. You take the man off the Widowmaker, you can't take him off the sniper roll though. Oh no. Oh, no Super no, no, setting no. up in the spawn camp. This, this is, is a very hard map to break the spawn camp. Especially against Reaper May. This is a very strong position to fight. May will isolate Sorry, out. She's not able to bubble in this fight. Okay, Super. He's still looking for the shatter. Gets stunned. Under pressure. Heard HP. He comes in. He's, he's oh. going to do it. Oh no, it's Gator. Gator strikes first with the shatter.
Yeah, Gator dropping some, some shade in the chat, although I don't think Super could have done anything. I'm pretty sure his shield was actually full smash, so no counter available. Gator playing the value game. It's really his teammates to set up that shatter. Big claim, Gator. All right, now a shatter going in from both sides, but grab Blizzard combo on the offense. They should be finishing this map right here. One good grab should be the end of the game. The problem is, can you get a location for the combo? Looks like you can. Well, both teams are suppressor. Locked, able to get locked down early. He missed Joy Blizzard. Stop. Notwithstanding, the beat is up now. The Blizzard, I don't know where it went. Erster, Striker, Super, both down. Advantage, I think it's too much, Jake. Yeah, Blizzard on card, gonna buy some stall time, but at this point, Shock, you have to play for the win. There's one kick on the dog, man. Striker finds another. Oh no, I think they're gonna do it right here. You got Batiste to the high ground, and it's Violet, no less. Healing up this Reaper. High noon needs to be huge. Game with the Shatter, is it enough? They're just keeping it off the card. Oh no, Spotted oh, is so coming in. Back. Edison back into the fray, takes down Violet, ends up on the Striker. You've got Gator still swinging oh, around no. the pit, but the spot advantage is too big. The shock coming out of spawn. They knock out the rain to the lower bracket, and history does not repeat itself here today.